How can you save money on your holiday travels? We'll find out in today's savings experiment. The Savings Experiment, presented by Bank of America, because frugal is the new cool. When it comes to your travel plans this holiday season, you'll likely be faced with the same question. Should I fly or should I just drive? While there's nothing like the open road, the prospect of sitting in traffic with screaming kids in the back seat makes you doubt driving will bring holiday cheer. Flying is fast, but sometimes fraught with crowded seats and unexpected delays. The positives and negatives of both options kind of cancel each other out, especially with gas and airline prices skyrocketing, so it may be hard to tell whether driving or flying is the better value. So, check out BeFrugal.com's Fly or Drive Calculator to make a more informed decision. You can fine-tune the search results for either option according to your own specific trip details. You can also utilize the personal finance app Mint. It advises that a trip with a drive time of 4 hours or less is the more cost-effective option versus flying. <laughs> Looks like a road trip to grandma's this year. Finally, for those who prefer a more flexible approach to their holiday travels, check out The Professional Hobo. By factoring in lodging and meals, this site gives you a good idea of how much you'll be spending each day of your trip. It can be a very convenient tool for more adventurous types. So travel safe and travel cheap and start the new year with some extra savings. Save some mashed potatoes for me, Grandma. For more great videos, come visit us at dailyfinance.com.